There is no better way to test the structural stability of a wall than to expose it to earthquake-like shakes in a controlled environment. After violent swaying of the test bed at Italy's Laboratory for Sustainable Innovation Technologies at Roma Tre University, both tested walls suffered some damage but were still standing. A seismic test was already conducted on these two walls in December. They've been brought to near collapse. They've been repaired now, and now we've verified the effects of this reinforcement. The wall on the right made of tuff, a volcanic ash sediment rock widely used in Italian classic architecture, was reinforced with basalt fiber net covered with mortar. The left wall, made of stone, was reinforced with a steel net, also covered with mortar, all manufactured by the construction company Caracol. We've verified how the stone wall, reinforced with the Caracol system, reached its stress limit with accelerations two and a half times stronger than those applied the last time. However, the tough wall reached its damage limit with even greater accelerations, two and a half times stronger than the L'Aquila quake. Shaking and damage were precisely measured by infrared cameras. Italian scientists say similar reinforcements can be applied to other types of walls. It can be used extremely well on walls in Turkey, where there are constructions of coarse concrete walls. It can also be applied to adobe, walls of rammed earth. In Peru and all over South America, there's a search going on about how to reinforce rammed earth structures. Researchers also are experimenting with other constructions, as well as replicas of ancient statues and monuments hoping to protect them from future earthquakes. George Putich, VOA News, Washington.